Alright, hey YouTube, this is Flaming Goldfish 23 here, and this is going to be a video on how to uh, install and use Mega 4i on your iPod Touch. This is an application that is going to give you um, free apps on your iPod Touch or iPhone. Um, the only downside to this app is um, when you get it, they decide on how many apps you get. Um, like every once in a while, you can only download one app. Sometimes you can download two, three, four, five, six, seven. It just depends on whatever their servers can handle that day, how many people are on their website. Um, but this is the alternative to Apulus or Apulo.us or Haculo. Uh, just because they've been down lately, I know they're back up again, but who knows? They might uh, crash again. So. This is just an alternative. So, uh, first thing you need to do is go to Mega4i website. That's www.mega4i.com, and register as a user there. I shouldn't have to show you how to do that. It's pretty self-explanatory. Um, but once you're registered and you've got confirmation email and activated your account, you need to go to Cydia and go to Manage. Uh, then sources, edit, then add, and then you need to type in the URL that I've put in the description, which is http dot dot slash slash um mega four i dot com. So m e g a Mega or I dot com slash R E P O slash. So it's going to look like um or maybe not. You can see it just a second ago. Oh well. It's http dot dot slash uh colon slash slash mega four I dot com slash repo slash so m e g a four i dot c o m forward slash r e p o forward slash should be in the description so just go there and then click add source once you have that you just go over to search and search in mega installer m e g a i n s t a l l e r and it should look like that right there. Mega installer. And you just click on that and download it and install it. And then what you're going to need to do is restart your iPod. And then you should get a little app that looks like this one right down here in the corner. It's a little App Store app. This is free across it. I don't know if you see it, but it's right here. Right there. So I'm just going to click on it. going to load. I don't know if I have a good internet connection, so if it doesn't, I'll just try and open it up again. Oh, cool. And then you guys are going to need to sign in, type in everything. I'm already ready, so I just click sign in, and it takes me to this. And then, see? All of these apps you can get. Alright, I'm going to see if I can get any. I, don't, I think I've already downloaded today, so I'm not sure if it'll, it'll, it'll let me do it again but I'll try anyways. Let's see, I'll get something I don't have. I have a lot of stuff. Let's try getting something small. Texas Hold'em. Uh -uh. See, Texas Hold'em right there. So you just click on it, and then click install. See? It'll pop up the cool thing that's right there. And it's telling me, uh, you may just get one program per day. Please come back in 24 hours. Uh, happens every once in a while when you take download too much. Just wait a little bit and it'll work again. But, that is how you do this. So, thank you. Comment, rate, and subscribe.